Noble playthrough. Female rogue on Dragon Age Origins, and I have not done a playthrough on this game in at least a few years. One of my favorite games of all time, obviously. Slash origin story area at the beginning. So we can start right here, where we do the Grey Warden ritual. But first we need to go into the wilds. With our other fellow Grey Warden recruits. If I'm not mistaken, there's also a prisoner over there. Let me check. Oh, I'll have to go over there in a bit. Let me just see over here if there are some. Uh, yeah, this is the books, I'm sure. Or something. Chest. Success. Studded boots. Sorry, but there's so much to do before the I have urgent duties. Alright. We'll also be coming back here for the Return to Oscar DLC. Maybe when maybe midway through the game or so. When we have more companions with us. Um I'm trying to remember where the guy in the cage is at. He's going to be executed somewhere. The there he is. Andraste, I bless you today. May you find favor in the I maker's eyes. The so let it Unless be. they're from Ole. Ah, I suspect you are one of the new Grey Wardens. Will you accept the maker's blessing? Sure, why not? I bless you, Grey Warden. In if the it name makes you feel better. And the maker above. May the chant of light carry your name to the ears of our Lord. Thank you, Chantry. Priest. Oh my god, there's some weird feedback. Here's the prisoner. Hang on. Okay, here we go. Huh. Someone finally comes and talks to the lone prisoner. I don't suppose you've come to sentence me. <sighs> I don't suppose you have a bit of kindness in you. All I want is food and water. Yep. They haven't fed me since I was locked up and I'm starving. I expect nobody thought of it with all the battles and such. Just ask my guard for his. He's still got some dead. Don't worry, you'll have your last meal coming. request, sir. I'm not such a barbarian like Lucky these other dog. people. You great wardens get to ride with the king while I'm left with the drudgery of guarding this deserter. <coughs> they should have just hanged him. Put his head on a pike as an example. They say he was recruited before the war up in Dinnerham. Probably figured he'd never have to fight if he served the king, right? Why does anyone want to desert? Because he thinks he's going to die and he's a bloody coward, that's why. Either that or he's been listening to a bunch of hogwash about how the dark spawn will drag you off and eat you. Don't expect I talked with him, actually. He asks for food and water. Since nobody sends me nothing to feed him with, the only way we'll get that is if I give him mine. So you miss one meal. This man could be hanged soon. <laughs> or you could pay him. I'll just do this. All right, all right. I guess the poor fella could stand to have one meal in his belly before he hangs. Coercion skills, everyone. I had nothing to do with it, though. If anyone asks why he's burping, I'm going to say it was you. Just so you know. That line always stuck with me. And we can feed him. So? Brought me some food of you? I'm so hungry I could faint dead away. Yep. Much obliged. You're a kind soul, you are. May Andraste herself rain blessings upon you. And that was a funny little quest we could do before we go into the wilds. I can I do anything? Nope. You may not want to remain here. And more Sorry, here. Sorry, the army camp is off limits for you right now. <coughs> okay. We pretty much... I also explored other parts of the camp before I started the stream. So, let's head back to where the ritual is going to be at. And we're not going to do the Mabari Warhound uh, side quest where you get the companion... The dog is the companion later on, because if you're a human noble, you start out with a dog. At the beginning of the game. 
What is it now? Alistair. Haven't Grey Wardens asked My future romance in this playthrough. I simply came to deliver Probably. a message from the revered mother, Sir Maid. She desires your presence. What her reverence desires is of no concern to me. I am busy helping the Grey Wardens by the King's orders, I might add. Should I have asked her to write a note? Tell her I will not be harassed in this manner. Yes, I was harassing you by delivering a message. Your glibness does you no credit. Here I thought we were getting along so well. I was even going to name one of my children after you. The getting along one. so well. Well, that's weird. Enough. I will speak to the woman if I must. Get out of my way, fool. <laughs> you know, one good thing about the blight is how it brings people together. Isn't it wonderful when tragedy is the only thing to bring us together, Alistair? It's like a party. We could all stand in a circle and hold hands. That would give the Darkspawn something to think about. <sighs> Wait, we haven't met, have we? I don't suppose you happen to be another mage. And that makes you Duncan's new recruit, I suppose. Pleasure to, meet, to meet you, Alistair. You. As the junior Future king of, the order, of Ferelden. I'll be you when you prepare for the joining. Right, that was the name. You know, it just occurred to me that there have never been many women in the Grey Wardens. I wonder why that is. Would that be so terrible? Not that I'm some drooling lecher or anything. Please stop looking at me like that. So I'm curious. Have you ever actually encountered Darkspawn before? Nope. When I fought my first one. No, sir. I wasn't prepared for how monstrous it was. I can't say I'm looking forward to encountering another. Anyhow, whenever you're ready, let's get back to Duncan. I imagine he's eager to get things started. What was that argu argument about, Alistair? The circle is here at the king's request. What that circle mage? The Chantry mage. doesn't like that one bit. They just love letting mages know how unwelcome they are. Which puts me in a bit of an awkward position. I was once a Templar. <coughs> that would be I'm most sure awkward, yes. Mother meant it as an insult Being a knight's Templar. Me as her messenger. And the mage picked right up on that. I never would have agreed to deliver it, but Duncan says we're all to cooperate and get along. Apparently, they didn't get the same speech. You do? Huh. That's a switch. If you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, lead on. Adventure awaits us in the woods. Hang on, I have a message from someone. Let me just check this really quick. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me just... All right. What up, Jesse? Pretty good. You found Alistair, did you? Good. I'll assume you're ready to begin preparations. Assuming, of course, that you're quite finished riling up mages, Alistair. What can I say? The revered mother ambushed me. The way she wields guilt, they should stick her in the army. She forced you to sass the mage, did she? We cannot afford to antagonize anyone, Alistair. We don't need to give anyone more ammunition against us. I apologize, Duncan. I'll go collect who we're missing. Are you going to get Battlefront 2? This is Sir Jory, a knight from Redcliffe. How do you do? And this, of course, is the recruit that Duncan said he was bringing. Now then, since you're all here, we can begin. You four will be heading into the Kokari Wilds to perform two tasks. The first is to obtain three vials of darkspawn blood, one for each recruit. For the joining itself, I'll explain more once you've reached. Shall drink the darkspawn blood. There was once a grey water. No, you have to. In the wilds. Abandoned yeah. long ago when we could no longer afford to maintain such remote outposts. It has recently come to our you attention have no choice. some scrolls have been left behind. And if you refuse, if you refuse to drink it, you just get, you get killed. Alistair, I want you to retrieve these scrolls if you can. 
The scrolls contain treaties promising support. Treaties that may prove valuable in the days to come. Watch over your charges, Alistair. Return I need to get Inquisition, the Game of the Year edition for Xbox One, because I bought it when it first came out three years ago, but I had the 360 version, and it was horrible, and I, I didn't really play it that much. Oh, you know how at the beginning of the game... I'm also streaming right now, so that's why I'm... Yeah. I'm doing, like, a stream playthrough. Um, you know at the beginning of the game where you go into the wilds and stuff to get the, the blood and stuff? Those two guys that get killed? What you can do... I'm gonna do it right now on the stream. I'm gonna get all their gear, like, all the shit they have, and, like, strip them of it. So that I'll have their gear after they're dead. And I can just sell it. <laughs> Even if they're naked with me, when we go into the woods, I don't care. They're going to die anyways. <laughs> this dude, yeah, their name, the names are uh, Jory and Davith. All right. Wait. Well, I'm told you all have business in the wilds. The Sounds open good. For you. Just be careful out there. Even a Grey Warden won't be safe in the forest tonight. It's m um. I'm not sure. Cause I know the game is more like Witcher, and they tried to make it more like like they they drew inspiration from Skyrim's like open world setting yeah overhead yeah overhead Yeah. Yeah. On the PC version for Origins, you can choose like overhead and pause combat and stuff, and there's like way more options. It's also awesome because you can mod it to hell on PC and do all kinds of stuff. Over here. The dying soldier. Who is that? Grey Wardens? Well, He's not half as dead as he looks, is he? My scouting band was attacked by Darkspawn. They came out of the ground. Please, help me. I've got to return to camp. Bandage him up. bandages in my pack. Thank you. Um, I... I've got to get out of here. Did you hear? An entire patrol of seasoned men killed by Darkspawn. Yeah, there's some really weird restrictions in DICE's Battlefront game. Those soldiers were careful, and they were still overwhelmed. How many Darkspawn can the four of us slay? A dozen? A hundred? There's an entire army in these forests. Oh, it's time There are Darkspawn about, but we're in no danger of walking into the bulk of the Horde. How do you know? I'm not a coward, but this is foolish and reckless. We should go back. Overcoming these dangers is part of the test, you coward. That's true. Know this. All Grey Wardens can sense Darkspawn. Whatever their cunning, I <sighs> guarantee they won't take us by surprise. That's why I'm here. You see, Sir Knight, we might die, but we'll be warned about it first. That is reassuring. Optimistic pessimism. It's easy, however. Or, so rather, optimistic... Uh, <laughs> Optimistic nihilism. 
Like we're gonna die, but we'll know about it before we do it. The red center. The kennel master Ostagar was asking about those. It probably is. You want to be careful picking flowers around the wilds, mind you. They're as like to spit poison your face as not. The kennel master said this flower can help dogs that get sick from biting darkspawn. At any rate, he was offering a reward if someone went into the wilds and brought him one. Might want to think about it, is all. Yep. I already have like 12 out roots for healing purposes. Oh, the Herlocks and the Genlocks. Yeah. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna die. This game must be crazy on Nightmare Difficulty. Thank goodness, Bioware lets you have three other companions in this game. Usually it's only two others. Look there, poor slobs. That just seems so excessive. Alright. Always fun to explore the map before you go to the main quest area. Well, there's some items or enemies you find. Yeah, this definitely looks like a game from yes. the, the late 2000s. Yeah, this. No, no, don't get me wrong, like. Even though by today's standards it might seem dated in a couple areas, visually, or gameplay-wise, it was, like, really badass back in the day. My goodness gracious. Aren't we already have the dark spawn blood, all right? We'll just keep exploring. Wait. You must strike quickly. Oh, the rogues. There we go. Money, and then this is probably money too. No, a Larian potion. It sucks that dwarves can't use magic. What a shame. <laughs> yeah. Muggles. Who told these things to come and play? <laughs> There's a quest, and, and when you're in Orzammar, the city for the dwarves, you come, uh, you come across a scholar, and she wants, <coughs> yeah, she wants to become a mage. Her parents got super pissed off at her. And you can convince her parents for her to leave and go to like the, uh, the Tower of Magi, and she goes there just to study. Even though you can't do magic. Oh, the alpha wolf. Damn. I'm gonna sell all these wolf... All these wolf pelts. Make a pretty penny.
Do I have anything interesting? Uh, oh, I have the studded leather because it's cured and not rough. Do that. Oh, it's also cured. Okay. And there's a chest. I'm 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 pretty sure there's an ambush here. Maybe. Nope. No ambush. Uh, flat blade. Oh, this is for the warrior class. All right. We have eighteen elk roots, and we have some other stuff. Okay. Did you ever play Dragon Age Two, Dagra? Dragon Age 2 was annoying in combat when you got damaged or injured. You'd have to use the injury kits on top of the health potions. A lot. Like, all the time. Hmm. Saving. This is where we meet the Witch of the Wilds. Oh, the emissary. Yes. Oh, I, I did not want to do that. I wanted to walk up to him and slash him. Not just do that. Taunt in front of him. Oh, this dude's walking away. Oh. I fucking died? He's just healing over and over again. Oh! Shield bashes out. Oh, he died. Oh no, there's another one. Still one more left. Excellent. There's an injury kit, you know, there's that. Dead soldier. A yellowed bloodstained page torn from a large book. Excerpt from local myths and legends. It's probably about the Witch of the Wilds. Pouch of Ashes. Is that from the... Urn of Sacred Ashes all the way out here? What the hell? I don't remember that. There's an ambush at this campfire. So, let's be careful. Yeah, there are some people who get like 90 kills every game and like one death in that game. <laughs> Acid flask, okay. Alright, let's... I don't remember if you can do a lesbian romance with Morgan, but we'll find out. I... I you can, okay, yeah. You just can't impregnate her to prevent anyone dying from the Archdemon at the end. So Alistair's going to die. Exhausted. 
vile and tainted creatures. Very well. Yes. Most people, I think, just don't like her personality. With how cold she is and stuff. <laughs> the Herlock Alpha drop. Ooh, enchanted dagger and some fire bolts and arrows. I'll look at that dagger. I do not, but I heard it's like a really hardcore crafting game. Enchanted dagger. It's a tier one, and this is tier two, okay. Oh no. Warden's cash. <sighs> Here's Morgan, there she is, well, with her titties well. almost hanging out. What have we here? The outfit's ridiculous. <laughs> it's just like a piece of cloth. I wonder. A scavenger poking amidst a corpse whose bones were long since cleaned? Or merely an intruder? Come into these dark spawn filled wilds of mine in search of easy prey. What say you? Hmm? Scavenger or intruder? You are the intruder here. I believe the first question is rightfully mine. I have watched your progress for some time. Where do they go, I wondered. Why are they here? And now you disturb ashes none have touched for so long. Why is that? Don't answer her. She looks chastened, and that means others may be nearby. Oh, you fear barbarians will swoop down upon you. Yes. She's a witch of the wild, she is. She'll turn us into toads. Witch of the wilds. Such idle fancies, those legends. Have you no minds of your own? You then. Women do not frighten like little boys. Tell me your name and I shall tell you mine. Pleasure to meet you. Now that is a Morgan. civil greeting, even here in the wilds. You may call me Morrigan. Shall I guess your purpose? You sought something in that chest? Something that is here no longer? Here no longer? You stole them, didn't you? You're some kind of sneaky <coughs> witch thief. How very eloquent. How does one steal from dead men? Quite easily, it seems. Those documents, and I said... Remove them. Invoke a name that means nothing here any longer if you wish. I am not threatened. Twas my vi Greetings, Mother. I bring before you four Grey Wardens who... I see them, girl. Hmm. Much as I expected. Are we supposed to believe you were expecting us? You are required to do nothing, least of all believe. Shut one's eyes tight or open one's arms wide. Either way, one's a fool. She's a witch, I tell you. We shouldn't be talking to her. Quiet, Dad. If she's really a witch, do you want to make her mad? Here's a smile. 
sadly irrelevant to the larger scheme of things, but it is not I who decides. Believe what you will. And what of you? Does your woman's mind give you a different viewpoint? Or do you believe as these boys do? Oh, if you must protest so quickly, perhaps I need not ask. So much about you is uncertain, and yet I believe. Do I? Why? It seems I do. So this is a dreaded Witch of the Wilds. Witch of the Wilds, huh? Morrigan must have told you that. She fancies such tales, though she would never admit it. Oh, how she dances under the moon. <laughs> They did not come to listen to your wild tales, Mother. True. They came for their treaties, yes? And before you begin barking, your precious seal wore off long ago. I have protected these. You... Oh, you protected them. And why not? Take them to your Grey Wardens and tell them this Blight's threat is greater than they realize. Such manners. Always in the last place you look. Like stockings. Oh, do not mind me. <laughs> you have what you came for. Time for you to go, then. Do not be ridiculous, girl. These are your guests. Oh, very well. I will show you out of the woods. Follow me. And we're back at camp. Before we return to Duncan, we're going to give this to the Mabari Kennelmaster. Greetings. Are you one of the Grey Wardens that went into the wilds? Did you happen to see any white flowers? I don't know for sure that the flower will aid my poor hounds, but it's worth Hey, Sean's on the line. Yeah, if you, if you start out the game as a human noble, a you already have a dog. You're very generous. Thank you for your help. Perhaps we won't lose as many hounds today as I'd feared. Yeah. The damn locked everything. Ooh, let's 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 allocate our skill points into we need more we need more health, that's for sure. There we go. Coercion. I just wanna get coercion out of the way and I don't have to worry about that. Master combat. Uh poison making herbalism's good to have and the stealing. I want to have coercion, just in case. Combat movement. Uh, do that one. Dual weapon strike. Riptosa. So you return from the wilds. Have you been successful? Yes, I have. Good. I've had the Circle Mages preparing. With the blood you've retrieved, we can begin the joining immediately. There was a woman at the tower, and her mother had scrolls. They were both very... odd. Were they wilder folk? I don't think so. They might be apostates. Mages hiding from the Chantry. I know you were once a Templar, Alistair, but Chantry business is not ours. We have the scrolls. Let us focus on the joining. <laughs> Much more than just apostates, Duncan. Do you remember Flemeth, Jesse? Excellent. Do you remember Flemeth, Morgan's mother? Comes next. Courage. How much they say, like, she, it's speculated she's just as powerful as the Archdemon. Heavy price to become what we are. Fate may decree that you pay your price now, rather than later. Yeah. 
Yeah. She can also switch like in and out of bodies. Which is pretty funny. She always has like a plan Z ahead of time. I agree. Wait, 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 wait. Let's let's invite Sean in here. He's online. He's on YouTube. Let's have it done. Then let us begin. Alistair, take them to the old temple. The old temple. Hello, Sean. We're streaming Dragon Age. The more I hear about this joining, the less I like it. Are you blubbering again? Why all these damn tests? Have I not earned my place? Maybe it's tradition. Maybe they're just trying to annoy you. I only know that my wife is in Hyover with a child on the way. If they had warned me, I... It just doesn't seem fair. Would you have come if they warned you? Maybe that's why they don't. The Wardens do what they must, right? Including sacrificing us? I'd sacrifice a lot more if I knew it would end the blight. Don't we? The Grey Wardens have saved the world from Darkspawn before. I'd say they know better than anyone what it takes. You saw those Darkspawns tonight. Wouldn't you die to protect your pretty wife from them? I... Maybe you'll die. Maybe we'll all die. If nobody stops the Darkspawn, we'll die for sure. I've just never faced a foe I could not engage with my blade. At last we come to the joining. The Grey Wardens were founded during the First Blight, when humanity stood on the verge of annihilation. So it was that the first gray war. Well, you can you can play Sea of Thieves on a Game Gear, because it has such low requirements. We're going to drink the blood of those those creatures, as the first gray wardens did before us, as we did before you. This is the source of our power and our victory. Those who survive the joining become immune to the taint. We can sense it in the darkspawn and use it to slay the archdemon. We speak only a few words prior to the joining, but these words have been said since the first. Alistair, if you would. Join us, brothers and sisters. Join us in the shadows where we stand vigilant. Join us as we carry the duty that cannot be forsworn. And should you perish, know that your sacrifice will not be forgotten. And that one day, we shall join you. Davith, step forward. Poor Davith. He seemed like a decent fellow. too much Th there is no glory in this I am sorry but the joining is not yet complete look at that blood you are called upon to submit yourself to the taint for the greater good. From this moment forth, you are a Grey Warden. It is finished. Welcome. Two more deaths. In my joining, only one of us died, 
but it was horrible. I'm glad at least one of you made it through. How do you feel? It's over. I'm fine. Dreams? I had terrible dreams after my joining. Such dreams come when you begin to sense the dark spawn, as we all do. That and many other things can be explained in the months to come. Before I forget, there is one last part to your joining. We take some of that blood and put it in a pendant. Something to remind us of those who didn't make it this far. Take some time. When you're ready, I'd like you to accompany me to a meeting with the king. The meeting is to the west, down the stairs. Please attend as soon as you're able. After the joining. Time for me to level up again. Oh wait, okay, let's do that. Deadly strike. Uh, let's put... Diff 10s, opening locks. It's like the people who only play Minecraft or Call of Duty. <clears throat> and here's when. Oh. Greetings, young lady. You are Duncan's newest recruit, are you not? He's not a man easily impressed. You should be proud. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Wynn, one of the mages summoned by the king. Well met, and good luck to you on the battlefield. To us all, in fact. Not precisely. The Grey Wardens will be on the front lines, not the mages. Still, we have our parts to play. To defeat the Darkspawn, we have to work together. It's not an idea everyone seems able to grasp. Some. Do you? Do you know about the connection between them and the Fade, for example? Anytime your spirit leaves your earthly body, whether it's to dream or to die, it passes into the realm we call the Fade. Yeah, you mages. It's many spirits, some benevolent, <sighs> others far less so. At the heart of the Fade lies the Black City. Some say the Black City was once the seat of the Maker. But when the mages from the Deventer Imperium found a way into the city, it was tainted with their sin. That taint transformed those men, turning them into twisted reflections of their own hearts. And the Maker cast them back to the Earth, where they da, became da, da, the first da, da, da. dark spawn. At least that's what the Chant of Light says. It may be allegory, meant to teach us that our own evil causes human suffering. Or it may be true. It is as good an explanation as any for now. Yes, occasionally it's wise to contemplate one's actions. But I'm certain Duncan has more for you to do than talk to me. Back again. Don't the Grey Wardens need you? <laughs> this is where the Battle of Ostagar is going to begin. Look carefully, man. This wretched thing is a darkspawn. They're strong and cunning and smart, but don't listen to those old wives' tales. They can be killed. Stick them with your sword and armor and they go down. Their blood is black as sin and poisonous. This is supposed to be the battle that sends these darkspawn back underground. Do you believe that? Hmm. I believe that's all there is in this camp.
We've explored every nook and cranny. We won't be down there on the battlefield, though. <coughs> Before the battle begins, I think I'll end the stream.